afternoon, good morning, and good evening, everyone, and welcome into the drawing show for the Brawl Stars Championship Last Chance Qualifier, powered by the Snapdragon Pro Series. The LCQ is the most anticipated event of the year thus far, taking place at Gamescom 2024 in Cologne, Germany, on the 24th through 25th of August. 12 top teams from around the world who came just shy of qualifying for the World Finals have a last shot at redemption to claim a golden ticket and join the eight teams who have already qualified. But with only four more spots available, this will be their greatest test of resilience yet. The format for day one will be a round robin, consisting of four groups and three teams within each group. From there, the top two teams within each group will move on to day two, where the elimination round begins and it's make or break. Win and you proceed to the World Finals. Lose and your 2024 journey is over. So now the stage is set, let's move on to the draw itself to find out which teams are going to face off on day one. So the first thing we need to do is to draw the regions into groups. And the main thing here to bear in mind is that we cannot have two of the same region be within the same group. So for example, if we draw EMEA into group A, followed by another instance of EMEA, that second drawing will be moved over to the next available group. So for this example, that would be group B and so on and so forth until all the groups are filled with no regional duplicates. Once we've established our regions, we'll then move on to phase two, which will be to draw from the pools of teams to finalize our groups. So without further ado, let's get into the draw. Okay then, starting with group A, we've got 12 cards in the bowl, one card for each regional slot that was allocated. So let's find out what the first region will be for group A. Let's see what it is. It is one card. And that card is. It is E M E A. E M E A in the group A. Let's now draw the second region and see what it will be. It is going to be. <laughs> what are the odds? <laughs> what are the odds? Well, you know the rules. EMEA will then be bumped over then to group B. My days. This next card will be for group A. And it is North America. Ooh, group A is already looking spicy. You love to see it. Okay. The final region for group A is we've got Chinese mainland going into group A right then let's see in group B then who is going to be joining EMEA and it is <laughs> it's EMEA <laughs> of course now the same rule applies EMEA will be going and bumping over then to group C Staying there with Group B. <laughs> EME is all done, so that's one thing to bear in mind. Right. <laughs> and it is Chinese Mainland for Group B. EME A and Chinese Mainland. Final region to join those in Group B is. It is APAC. APAC then going in to Group B. Let's find out who's going to be the first team to join EMEA in Group C. Here's APAC. Going in to Group C. And to join those two regions in Group C. It's... Can't open it. Uh, it is South America. South America going in to Group C. So Group C will be EMEA, APAC, and South America. Right. Well, we already know there can only be three regions now for Group D. And those regions are South America, North America, and finally, Chinese mainland. So to recap all the groups in Group A, we've got EMEA. North America and Chinese Mainland. For Group B, we've got EMEA, Chinese Mainland, and APAC. For Group C, we've got EMEA, APAC, and South America. And for Group D, we have North America, 
Chinese mainland, and South America. Okay, now that we've got all of our regions drawn into groups, let's move on to draw the teams that will occupy those groups. So starting then with Group A, we've got our EMEA bag. Let's put them into the bowl and draw our first team, which is... It is STMN Esports going in to Group A. We'll put... The remaining two back in the bag for later and move on to Chinese mainland going into the bowl who is going to join STMN esports we're about to find out and it is it is connections connections going in to group A and we'll place the remaining two back in to the bag. And for now, for North America, we know we're going to be able to determine actually two of these two teams in this one draw. So, for Group A, first and foremost, who is going to be joining STMN Esports and Connections? It is... It is Luminosity Gaming. Luminosity Gaming, STMN, and Connections all in Group A, which means the team from North America that will be going in to Group D, of course, is Tribe Gaming. Lying in wait. Moving on then to Group B now. So let's draw our first team for EMEA in Group B. We want a two. Who is it going to be? Let's find out. It is Reply Totem. Going into Group B, Reply Totem for EMEA. And that does mean as well that by process of elimination, we have got our third and final EMEA team from the bowl going in to Group C, which is Eclipsar Esports. Fantastic stuff. EMEA all wrapped up as far as the bowls are concerned. Now, for Chinese mainland, we place those two teams in the bowl, and we'll be able to determine as well here, both Group B and Group D. Starting with Group B, the Chinese mainland team is... It is Toxic Lotus for Group B, which means the final team for Chinese mainland out of the bowl is... Venice. So we've already got in Group D, Tribe Gaming and Venice. Okay, now for APAC, two teams going into the bowl. Let's see which team it is going to be to finalize Group B. And it is Navi. Navi going into Group B to join Reply Totem and Toxic Lotus, which means the final team for APAC left in the bowl. is BC Gaming. Going in then to Group C to join Eclipsar Esports. So now we've got two teams for South America going to be going into the bowl. And this team will be to determine who is going to be joining in Group C. But it will actually also finalize the entire grouping as well. So let's see which team from South America will go into Group C. And it is Team Keso. Team Keso, Eclipse RA Sports, and BC Gaming for Group C, which means that in Group D, we will have our final South American team, which is Foot Esports. Let's just recap now all of the groups to see where our teams landed to refresh our memories. In Group A, we have STMN Esports, Luminosity Gaming, and Connections. In Group B, we have Reply Totem, Toxic Lotus, and Navi. In Group C, we have Eclipse RE Sports, BC Gaming, and Team Queso. And for Group D, we have Foot Esports, Tribe Gaming, and Fairness. And there you have it. Our last chance qualifier table is set.
And those dates, once again, are the 24th through 25th of August. So mark those in your calendars and watch live on events.brawlstars.com, where you can sync your Supercell ID and earn a ton of in-game rewards to progress your accounts along the way. From us here, that's all for now. We'll see you at the LCQ.